Reading. 1. Work in pairs and discuss. Which alternative is true for you? 1. I take photos with my camera slash my mobile slash my camera and mobile. 2. My favorite subjects are people slash places. 3. I put my photos online slash in a book. 4. I write comments on the photos in English slash my language. 1. Researchers from Penn University looked at over 15 million Facebook messages, and tried to answer some questions. Do men and women use different words in their messages? How is the language of a younger and older person different? They found some surprising things. 2. The researchers studied messages from over 75,000 people. They looked at the language in the messages and also the most popular topics for messages. 3. They found some big differences between men and women. Women use more adjectives and phrases for feelings, for example, excited, wonderful, love you, and the emoticon for a heart. They often talk about family and friends. 4. Men talk about sport, computers, game consoles and videos, Xbox and YouTube are popular. They also often use swear words. It's interesting that men use, my wife, and, my girlfriend, more than women. Women often put, amazing, in front of, husband, or, boyfriend. 5. And what about age? It isn't surprising that 13 to 18 year old kids talk about school a lot, school, homework, English, but people from 23 to 29 speak about work, at work, new job, office. Older people are more interested in family and friends and their favorite words are, son, daughter, my kids, and, friends. 6. So, let's see how the research works for us. Look at these messages from two friends. What can you say about the writers? Wonderful birthday. Katya brought me breakfast in bed this morning and now Yuri is cooking dinner, tomato, pasta. I'm lucky to have such a lovely family. I am having a great time here in Brazil with my girlfriend. We're relaxing by the swimming pool and Brazil won the football last night. Life is perfect. Thinking about you all in the office. See you next week. 2. A. Read the introduction to the article, paragraph 1, and choose the best title. Your age, your personality. Women talk more than men. Your words, your identity. Your words, your identity. B. Work in pairs. Match the people in A to the language in B. A. People. B. Words people use. 1. Women. D. Love. 2. Men. E. YouTube. 3. Teenagers. C. Homework. 4. People in their 20s. B. At work. 5. People from 30 to 65. A. Daughter. C. Read paragraphs 2 to 5 and check your ideas. D. Read paragraph 6 and answer the writer's question. Check your answer on page 168. The first writer is probably a woman in her 30s. The second writer is probably a man in his 20s. E. Work with other students. Do you agree with the research? Is it true for you or your friends? Grammar. Present continuous. 3. A. Complete the table. Use examples from the messages. Yuri is cooking dinner. 
I'm having a great time. We're relaxing by the swimming pool. B. Underline the correct alternative to complete the rule. Use the present continuous to talk about your life at this moment. Make the present continuous with subject plus be plus verb plus ing. Unit 8. Now. Recording 1. 1. What are you thinking about? 2. What's he doing? 1. What are you thinking about? 2. What's he doing? 8. Language Bank. Grammar. 8.1. Present Continuous. I am having a great time. He's sitting on the balcony. She's sitting on the balcony. It's sitting on the balcony. You're waiting for a train. We're waiting for a train. They're waiting for a train. I am not enjoying this food. He isn't working at the moment. She isn't working at the moment. It isn't working at the moment. You aren't doing anything. 8. Language Bank. Grammar. 8.1. Present continuous. I am having a great time. He's sitting on the balcony. She's sitting on the balcony. It's sitting on the balcony. You're waiting for a train. We're waiting for a train. They're waiting for a train. I am not enjoying this food. He isn't working at the moment. She isn't working at the moment. It isn't working at the moment. You aren't doing anything. We aren't doing anything. They aren't doing anything. Am I? Yes I am. No I am not. Are you leaving? Yes you are. No you are not. Are we leaving? Yes we are. No we are not. Are they leaving? Yes they are. No they are not. Is he working? Yes he is. No, he is not. Is she working? Yes she is. No, she is not. Is it working? Yes it is. No, it is not. Use the present continuous to speak about something happening now, at this moment. In speaking or in emails and letters to friends, usually use the contracted form, I am reading, equals I am reading. In the negative, it is also possible to use, he's not working, they're not doing anything. Don't use contractions in positive short answers, yes, we are, not s greater than wete. Spelling the ing form. Most verbs plus ing. Wait do. Wait waiting. Verbs ending in e, e plus ing. Wait take. Wait taking. Most verbs ending in a consonant vowel consonant. Double the final consonant ing run running. Swim run. Swimming running. We aren't doing anything. They aren't doing anything. Practice. 8.1 A. Write the ing form of the verbs. 1 live. Living. 2 dot go. Going. 3. Come. Coming. 4. Put. Pudding. 5. Feel. Feeling. 6. Make. Making. 7. Get. Getting. 8. Stand. Standing. 9. Drive. Driving. 10. Meet. Meeting. Write a phone conversation using the prompts below. Bruno, 
Hi, Gerald. It's me. Are you sleeping? Gerald, no, I'm at work. I'm reading. Bruno, what you read? What are you reading? Gerald, I'm eating some reports. What are you doing? Bruno, Carl and are playing cards and listening TC music. Gerald, so you aren't working today. Bruno, well, we're taking a break. Gerald, R.O. I'm talking on the speaker phone. My boss is listening. Bruno, are you joking? Boss, no, he isn't joking. 4. A. Match photos AC with comments 1 to 3. 1. B. 2. A. 3. C. B. Complete the comments above with verbs from the box. Dance. Chat. Eat. Enjoy. Feel. Play. Sing. Take. Wait. 1. Great party. The kids are dancing in the garden and we're enjoying the beautiful spring day. I am chatting with Laura's mum and we re eating another piece of cake. 2. Don't come to Rome in summer. We are waiting for the museum to open. My husband's taking pictures of the buildings and the crowd. I am feeling very bored. 3. We are listening to Sarah and Jeff. They are making a new CD at the studio. I love Sarah's voice. She is singing and Jeff is playing guitar, and they sound great. C. Work in pairs. Student A. Choose a person from one of the photos. Student B. Ask yes, no questions in the present continuous and guess who it is. A. It's a man. B. OK. Is he standing in a queue? A. No. He isn't. D. Work in pairs and take turns. Write the names of three people you know. What are they doing now? My friend Julia lives in Sydney. I think she's getting up now. Vocabulary. Verbs plus prepositions. 5. A. Complete the sentences. Check in the reading. They also looked at the language. Men often talk about sport. B. Underline the correct alternative. 1. Think about a problem. 2. Listen to the radio. 3. Take a photo of a friend. 4. Wait for a train. 5. Read about a film star. 6. Chat with a friend. 7. Talk on the phone. 8. Ask about pronunciation. Unit 8. Recording 2. 1. Think about a problem. Two. Listen to the radio. Three. Take a photo of a friend. Four. Wait for a train. Five. Read about a film star. Six. Chat with a friend. Seven. Talk on the phone. Eight. Ask about pronunciation. Speaking. 6. Work in pairs. 
Student A. Look at page 165. Student B. Look at page 168. In Student B's picture Keiko's wearing sunglasses. Komoko's talking, not texting on her mobile, and she's wearing a green top, not a blue one. Mike's holding a sandwich, not eating it. Andrea's looking at his mobile, not at the Coldplay concert poster. Angie's looking at her watch. Jim's holding a newspaper, not reading it. Victor's running but he isn't carrying a bottle of water. Writing. Pronouns. 7. A. Match this comment with one of the comments in exercise 4a. I saw them at a club last week. They were great, and her voice is amazing. 3. B. Read the comment above again. Write the people's names under the pronouns them, they and her. Them. Sarah and Jeff. They. Sarah and Jeff. Her. Sarah. C. Read more comments below. Use pronouns to replace the underlined phrases. Where did you take the photo of them? She looks tired. That's not good for her voice. I have their last CD. It was great. D. Write a comment to go with a photo. Write two or three sentences and use pronouns. E. Swap your message with other students. Write a new comment about their photos.